everybody welcome back to g mama's world where i'm coming to you with another seafood mukbang i have fried fish catfish and fried shrimps with a salad with tomatoes cucumbers chopped turkey relishes and cheese okay guys and i'm gonna be topping it off with the ranch dressing and I will be topping my fish off with the beloved sauce. I mean, hot sauce. And you already know what I'm drinking. Got the pepper. Alrighty, guys. Let's take my thumbnail and we're going to get started. Alrighty. Let's take another one. Let's see. Oh, I forgot to give me some lemon. Okay, we're going to pray and we're going to get started. Amen. Comment down below. Let me know what you, what you think about this uh, seafood mukbang. Hit, uh, give it a thumbs up. Hit the notification bell so you'll know every time I drop a new video. Share this video with each and every one you come across. And most importantly, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so. Okay? And guys... I will be putting this video out in the morning. Instead of my coupon uh, video, I will put it out on Thursday. But those are the ones that will be going to the meet and greet. If you was going and uh, you got a text or whatever saying it was canceled, I will still be in Houston Friday through Sunday. If you still want to do a collab with me or if you're still going to be in Houston, me, myself, Lisa Michelle, uh, I don't know about Miss C. Corners, but we still will be doing collabs in Houston, Texas this weekend. I still will be in Houston if you see this video. Just go to my Instagram and let me know, okay? this to the side so I can do this okay this Hot y'all, I just fried it. This is so good. It's so good. Y'all, this is my first time frying the shrimp. I always saute them. Mm-hmm. 
this season. Mm -mm -mm. Season is good. Even though I didn't take the shale off, it went through it. I used that uh, Louisiana fish fry, so I I did with I left the shell on it. That way, it cut down on some of that as salt. That's why I left the shell on. This one stuck on now. Mm -hmm. Oh, these are so good. This season went all the way down in it. Now, if that season to go all the way down inside of a shell, just imagine what they'd be doing if you didn't have a shell on there. Mm -mm -mm. Scooted the salad. I was oh, <laughs> I should have just did fries instead of this salad. Oh, this so good. Normally, my salad be the first thing to leave. <laughs> I was going to do a, oh, that's my dog, y'all. Yeah, I was trying to get there 15 minutes. But I was going to do a steak. And change my mind. Y'all already know. Gee, mama going through some things tonight, y'all. Charge it to my my mind, not my heart. Here y'all go. I here you got their beloved hot sauce on it. And I already ate out my fork, so y'all got to miss the salad. Give you extra shrimp for your salad. <laughs> extra shrimp for your salad. Mm -hmm. But yes, guys. Casey had something to come up. 
unfortunately she had to cancel at the last minute but since i got a hotel room already and i can't cancel it so i will be in houston friday through sunday so if you was coming i would still be there You can inbox me on Instagram and we can meet up at a location if you're coming anyway. I don't know who all would see it. I need to give me some crawfish. I ain't had no crawfish in a minute. Do crawfish and mussels together. Potatoes and corn. Who all like crawfish and mussels? Crawfish and mussels. Who all like that? Trying to get their little 15 minutes today. Someday they sit out there, you don't even hear. Oh, excuse me, y'all. Now they wanna. Somebody must be out there walking. Yeah. 
good. It felt good and crunchy. my praise so y'all yeah, won't see my trash y'all when is this rain gonna let up I don't know about y'all parts of the world but Dallas or Texas I don't know when this rain gonna let up and it don't be sprinkling it been raining Y'all, I'm being fooled. It's all I have left. And this, the salad. I 
want you to comment down below. Let me know what you thought about this video. Ooh, the hot sauce. Mm, it's burning. I guess it depends on what you eat. You really taste it. Comment down below. Let me know what you thought about this video. Give it a thumbs up. Hit the notification bell so you'll be notified every time I drop a video. Share this video with each and every one you come in contact with. And most importantly, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so. Oh, yeah. Thought I had the bird. If ain't nobody told you they love you today, always remember G-Mama loves you and Jesus loves you. It don't take anything to say kind words to people. They coming towards your way, smile. It don't cost you anything to smile at someone or speak to someone because you may be saving their personal life or someone else's life. If someone is doing something to you to the point where you stop talking to that person because they're offended you, the Bible say go to that person and straight go go to that person that you have an old against and get it straight. So if a person that did something to you, whether it's me or anybody else, allow that person a chance to explain themselves. Allow that person a chance to see what they have done wrong so they can apologize. That's what's so wrong with us now. We hold things in our heart to where it turns our heart into stone. We don't speak to a person. We don't talk to a person. And then we go on and the enemy causes us because our heart is stone causes us to lie and turn the truth into negative. So if a person have did anything to you, allow that person to uh, get it straight. Okay? Because the time is winding up and the days are short. Too short to be carrying on ill feelings towards one another when it could be just easily a misunderstanding. So, again, if a person have did something to you, give that person a chance to get it straight. Don't carry ill feelings in your heart to where your heart becomes stone. Whether it's a family member, a friend, brother, a sister, whoever. Okay, guys? And with that being said, until I see y'all in another video, be kind to one another, love one another, and y'all be safe. Peace.